Hello, my name is Ariemi for Clueless Junkie. In this video, I'll be showing you how a roof concrete fascia is done. I'll be talking about the formwork, reinforcement, and concreting for an in situ type roof concrete fascia. If you're new to this channel, please subscribe, join, and leave a comment, I'll be happy to respond. Without further ado, as soon as the final blockwork leveling for the building has been achieved, the roof beams, the boarding for the roof beams are placed and uh, adequate bracing is uh, applied. The details for the roof beams are usually in the structural drawings. As soon as the boarding for the beams have been done, the perimeter of the building is then prepared for the formwork for the concrete fascia. Specially constructed braces are prepared and attached evenly to the external part of the perimeter boarding. These braces will provide support for the wood formwork for the concrete fascia. 1 by 12 wood is then placed on top of the braces and uh, these will provide a needed shape for the concrete fascia. The design for the fascia is adhered to and uh, in this case the risers for the steps is placed with details that is with accurate measurement it is important that the formwork is constructed to the proposed design and uh, the the thread in this case a one by three wood is also placed on top of the already placed riser and then as these steps are being constructed adequate braces are applied and uh, this will go a long way in providing additional support for the wood assemblage uh, to prevent accidents and whatnot. And uh, as soon as the needed number of steps for the concrete fascia has been attached, it is important that more braces is uh, applied to the wood formwork. Uh, to avoid accidents and to prepare the place for the users of the formwork, that's the iron workers and the construction workers, provide the needed support and uh, prevent accidents and breakage. These um, additional supports are illustrated as such. There is quite a number of ways it can be done. This is one of the many ways in which these uh, supports can be placed to prevent breakage. Uh, for the formwork and all. And uh, when this is uh, achieved, the next thing will be for the re reinforcement, the rebars to be installed. And uh, the iron worker will place these uh, reinforcements. The links for the beams are prepared, especially to take the shape of the concrete fascia. It is very important that they are specially prepared and uh, they are well installed by the iron worker to provide needed reinforcement for the concrete. And uh, the links are installed evenly and tied properly around the beams. And then additional rebar is installed, distributors to go around the formwork provide uh, the needed mesh kind of mesh yes for the concrete fascia and uh, once this has been done the whole assemblage is then uh, prepared where there is need to install spacers concrete spacers that will be done and then uh, quarter rods are attached to the beams these quarter rods will eventually tie the wall plate the wood wall plate on top of the fascia this doesn't look so nice it can be better and uh, 
after it's done and uh, rendered looks not so bad i hope this sheds more light to you please subscribe and uh, join leave a comment i'll be happy to get back to you catch you on the next one